Hi, this is David Summer. Today I'm going to show you how I find properties that haven't been selling and actually find out some more history about the properties which can help me in my negotiations with the seller. So I'm using the Firefox browser and I'm using a plugin called Property B. You simply go to www.property-b.com then if you click on the link install the, the version number will change over time but that, the link is there it'll add the plugin to the Firefox browser once installed you get this bar on the browser which shows you that property B is working okay now to find property I use rightmove.co.uk which is the biggest property portal in the UK. Here I'm setting up a new search. I'm looking in Bromley. Um, let's choose a price range of say minimum 100,000. I'm also going to check this box um, which means that property that has been sold will still be shown in my results. One in three properties that are sold and fall through so it's always useful to keep an eye on properties that are sold. So I'm going to click there, find properties. I'm going to order lowest to highest. Now, if I scroll down, beneath each property now, there's this blue box. This is what Property B um, is telling us. So let's find one with more information. That's a garage, not particularly interested in that. Right, okay, let's look at this one here. So we have a one bed flat in the high street for £125,000. Here the box is saying it came on the market on the 19th of June 2012. Um, it was originally on for 134995 They actually upped the price in December. Then they dropped the price in May 2013, etc. So this can give you really useful information, um, knowing how long it's been on the market and what they've done to the price. It can tell you basically how motivated the person is um, that's selling the property. And you can other see things like if it's been sold and then the sale's fallen through. By the time that's happened two or three times, again, the, the seller might be very motivated.